no secret that you don't have to drive very far on Corpus Christi streets before you hit a pothole. Tonight we're going to talk about a side street chase driver. The folks who live there are like, come on already, fix this. Well, they're really fed up, Andy, because the city crews, they're not really fixing the problem. They're just patching up the street. But those temporary fixes erode with the next rain or a large truck that passes through. Our Myra Cordova has all the details for us tonight. If you've never passed through Chase Drive, you better brace yourself for a bumpy ride. You hit down there and it's like, da, 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 you're a vibrating machine. Kara Moore has lived here since the 50s. I can remember when they used to have the street sweepers go down and clean your alleyway. And says it's been years. I can't even remember, 30, 40 years ago. Since the street was replaced. They do skip holes and they don't even patch them up right. Everyday neighbors are forced to maneuver around potholes. You live here, you kind of learn where they are and you kind of avoid them. And avoiding a pothole on the roadway isn't the only problem. Neighbors also worry about exiting their driveway. At our driveway, big old holes, big old holes. It hits the back end. Nancy Omsberg says she's tired of temporary fixes. They only last until the next rain or large truck passes through. We can't afford to buy new cars and stuff, new tires. But every time her son calls the city, they just put you on hold, wait for a while. Nothing gets done. More fears the potholes give the neighborhood a bad image. That house with the red light has been on sale for over a year. She says the city needs to focus on residential streets. These big streets, they're not near the bad shape because after all we live here we pay our property taxes now we have to pay that extra street usage tax the neighbors are doing their part the city needs to do theirs Mayra Cordova action 10 news now the city tells us they're aware that chase drive needs to be reconstructed but they say it's a candidate for the street reconstruction program in bond 18 at the moment the streets have not been selected while the city is working on gathering money for that. They will now continue, though, the uh, temporary fixes.